Hello and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing good. Um, and if you're new here, my name is Cooper and I do motherhood and lifestyle vlogs and other daily routines. And we also do a lot of outdoor videos because I am in Park and Rec and I love to do climbing, to do rock climbing and kayaking and anything outdoor related. Of course, right now it's kind of been cut. Minimal has been cut down minimally and we do a lot of things out in our own backyard. And right now there is also going to be a lot of videos on decor and decorating because we just moved because we're in the military, we just got stationed elsewhere and we just moved. So I am currently trying to find the perfect way to make my house look beautiful. So I'm going to be putting up videos showing that process. Click the subscribe button down below if you enjoy what you're seeing. And if you can't tell throughout the rest of the video, I am wearing different glasses. That's because my dog chewed up my other ones. So I went out and got these and I am recording this afterwards. Today's video is also in collaboration with my sweet friend, Carolyn at Basic Bahai. In her video, she will be DIYing a coffee bar, which will also be the new home for her Keurig and Nespresso machines. And she's updating this old dresser that will be used to organize all of her snacks for her and her boyfriend. She is an obsessive Harry Potter fan, which I absolutely love. We are obsessive together. And she loves makeovers and crafting and all things home decor and Disney or pop culture. So please go check out her channel, you will love today, it. You are gonna see this hutch behind me get transformed into this, but first off, it's going to start off looking like this. So here is the bottom of the dresser. I am about to start on this first. There's Tucker and Bennett, did you put the leash on Tucker? Yeah. And his leash. So the outside is gonna be white. But I'm doing this first because I want this to completely dry overnight. Let me back up. Back up, back up. All right, as you can see, my whole dining room has kind of turned into a painting area. We've moved over the table. Tech can still get in his cage though, so. I'm starting with the white, of course. And the white color we got is, I believe it was called cottage white. The wood cleaner I used is this Method one. I am not a fan of this, but it's the only one I have right now, so I just used it. But yeah, I'm hoping to get a huge chunk of this done, done right now, like in one chunk, like not taking breaks because Chris just left with Scarlett to go run some errands and then also go to Lowe's because he's picking up some stuff for the grill. And Bennett is having quiet time right now. Also, I just wanted to say that beauty back there, sorry, I'm shaking because this dog is getting in my lap. That beauty back there was being sold on Facebook Marketplace for $30, yeah, 30. So we snagged it because we're just repurposing it into this coffee bar. Take a moment to stop and say, this is what it looks like right now. I really like the color it's coming out right now. My husband is so upset I'm painting this because he loves the natural wood, but I think white's gonna look so much better. Can you paint it red too? Yes, we're gonna paint the back of it red. What do you think, Bennett? Do you like it? Mm -hmm. Can you kind of go help? I'm thinking doing red. Hi, Hello, we. Are you gonna help, Daddy? Well, the whole, the bars. Or are you just taking like the top? 
and now both of your helpers are here. Hi, helper baby. Hi, you sitting. <laughs> oh, now they're both sitting. back of it red, it won't get the white part. Are you going to go watch Transformers now, Scarlet? Nope. Back to Daddy. It did dry, didn't it? Oh, that's awesome. Oh, really? How's it going? Alright, I covered the top of the surface of the Shelby Dads, and then I just went around where it hits the sides on this part. Because oh, yeah. if you're going to do this red mm -hmm. and leave this white, and you know, now you've got a surface to be tricky right. about. And then, do you have any suggestions? Because this just keeps falling. Uh, take it out? <laughs> no, I mean like... Like literally take it out. No, I mean like for long term. Oh, you mean for putting it on there long term? Yeah, for nails. long term because it keeps falling. I'm just gonna use nails because nails are nice. I like nails. Okay. Oh, yeah, it's the next day now and so much brighter, so I'm hoping I can get a little bit better footage right now. But um, I'm gonna go, and as you can see, I've got a lot of streaks here that I need to touch up. I've gotten all I've gotten all the white down with the china cabinet, but I just don't like quite how it looks. I know that Chris wants it distressed looking, so there's gonna be some spots that I purposely leave, but I think I um, overdid it on this streaking. So I'm gonna just go back and put some more white on real quick. Bottom to red done, and for the 
for the longest time I could not decide if I was gonna do this white or red, but we ended up deciding to do red. Uh, Chris wanted red more and honestly, it's an amazing thing. Anybody else hear that pop? Part of my handheld. Right. That's a big yawn. <laughs> so my handheld tripod. This just popped off. I'm gonna have to fix that. I don't think so. I think it's only like women being shirtless that is an issue. Good. I like it. What do you think? I'm happy. If it's Now that we've got this put together, let's test this. Oops. Well, gotta move that out. 
Okay, we've got it. And let's. Ooh, so pretty, really, do you think? Are we making mommy some coffee? Are we making mommy some coffee? Oh, baby squirrel. Baby squirrel? Making mommy some coffee. So pretty. So pretty. Mommy gonna be so happy. Mommy gonna be so happy. What you think, Squirrely? What you think? Oh my goodness. Rise and shine, Mommy. Look alive. Pushing button, squirrel. Ah, blah, blah. I smell it. Okay, what'd you do to get it to work? Oh, did you did you figure it out? Squirrely, did you figure out how to make mommy her coffee? What'd you do? Oh, ho, 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 ho. You know, I don't think he knows either. Bennett. Oh, hello there, doggy. What do you think, Bennett? Oh, tell me what you think best about mommy's coffee bottle. What is it? The owl one, is it? You like the owl one the best in here? What do you like best in here? The owl one. As you can see behind me, we are done. You're going to show it off? Yeah. We're going to be leaving soon, Bennett. Let's start with the top shelf. So the top shelf, I have my little Pop Funko Voldemort and Bellatrix and Draco. And then these books. So these, so those four books are a set that are coming out every couple of months so only the first four are out right now so i have those and i'm a gryffindor so i have the gryffindor colors but you can get them in each house color and then moving on to the second section we have my little mini quidditch set and the dumbledore card and my little frog and a couple of wands i can't find some more of my wands, but those are the ones I have that I found. And then the next section, we've got my Tri Wizard Cup candle. It smells like blueberry, by the way. And that's the top, it's got a little dragon. And then you've got my flu powder and my little Jiminy Cricket. Focus. And then moving down, we have my Jiminy Cricket and all of my pens. Let me just show them. Oh, Hi, Bennett. And all my little pens. And then I have some of these mugs. <laughs> and then we have the Harry, Hermione, and Ron Pop Funkos. And then my Keurig. And then my Keurig, the one thing I don't like about it is that it clashes with this, but it is what it is. And my Mushu figurine. And then my Nespresso that just finished brewing a cup of coffee for me in my Hedwig cup. And then my Beauty and the Beast, Once Upon a Time. I love this one so much. Then we have my Ministry of Magic coin over here. So stepping back, 
this is what it looks like. And then we have just some little twinkle lights hanging up here. And then there's a built-in light up here. And then we have our, um, if I can get it in the picture, we have our extension cord nailed here. Thank you, Scarlett, for playing with that. Okay, where's your computer? It's on the um, kitchen counter with all my camera batteries and stuff. No, you what? Camera batteries. All right, back in those two? Yes. Or you can just throw them in the front of the car. All right. And I think I've said this before, but we chose the red in the background for Gryffindor colors hi. and for Mickey Mouse and all that colors. <gasps> See, hi! I'm so happy with this. Yes. This is what this beautiful thing looks like without the lights on. I apologize if you hear my dishwasher going. Here's a last minute addition I added. So let's see if it focuses. Might have to turn the lights back on. Here we go. Let's see if this works. Womp. I absolutely love this piece. It's a little chess piece. And then this is the contact paper we used. It is a marble color. And the reason we did that is so that if this drips, which as you can see there's already a coffee spill, it can go on the contact paper and not on the actual shine cabinet. And this is the Mermaid in the Mirror from the Tri Wizard Cup area with the egg. And that's a little bookmark, so I put it with the books. But I think the red turned out beautiful. I think it's definitely Gryffindor colors. I, my husband's favorite thing in this whole area, in this whole coffee bar, would be the Jiminy Cricket. I just got about a week ago for a birthday present. And then he cracks me up here because this is Mushu and he swears it looks like he's ringing. He's banging this and saying, wake up, time for coffee. It just cracks me up. Then here is my little Harry Potter espresso cup. Let me see if I can step back all the way so you can see the whole entire thing. Might be a little difficult because this thing's huge. There we go.